Hi everyone, it's Mermaid Jaffa. In today's video, we'll talk about prescription swimming goggles. I've been buying prescription swimming goggles since I started mermaiding in 2014. The two major brands that I buy from is Eyeline and the second brand that I buy is Aquavis. So let's start with Eyeline because that's the one um, that I really go back to when I can't find options for style and aesthetics and everything else. So this are, these are what they look like. They just look like normal swimming goggles. Um, you can buy the, I call them eye cups or they're probably called lenses. I don't know what they're called but you can buy these separately from each other so if you've got a lower power in one eye or a higher power in the other eye you can just buy them separately on the website they cost about i think about 20 25 dollars for each eye cup sometimes they have a, a sale or discount so you can get them under under uh, twenty dollars for each eye cup, but it just depends when the sale is because I don't really check unless I need to buy a new set of goggles. <laughs> so I really do like these. These these are a minus ten of on both sides because my current prescription of my glasses is minus ten on both sides or thereabouts. Um, it doesn't. These goggles doesn't have the excess and the cylinder or, or whatever you know that that usually have when you buy a uh, custom goggles or custom lenses they don't have the excess and the cylinder and the spear and all that on these one they just they just come as minus whatever and a minus whatever there's no that's none of that stuff so um the straps and the rubber part of the goggles I think they call a gasket I'm not really sure what this rubber part but I think it's called gasket I'm not sure um, so yeah these ones are made of rubber but um, they're easily replaced because they, they they sell them for under ten dollars about five five or six dollars for a strap anyway so it, um, it's really not that expensive if you take care of your goggles and then you just replace it when it breaks that's it so they do last a long time my old pair that I had of these goggles um, I replaced the strap after one about a year and a half because they finally broke after a year and a half <laughs> and the nose piece I replaced it after about a year because um, they sort of got rotten and I, wa I was flicking the water from it and it sort of broke the nose strap. But luckily at that time at the swimming pool I had a bit of um, thick cord that was part of the decoration of my backpack so I just undid that <laughs> thick cord and strung it through the, the little holes in the side and just tie them off so it looks like I had two antennas sticking out from my nose like that. <laughs> <laughs> it was quite funny. <laughs> they were bright orange too, so they really didn't really match the goggles, but they looked so weird, like little antennas or feelers that came out from the goggles like that. <laughs> so that was quite funny. So I like these um, basically for the price. Like you, you get two together, it's just under $50. So it's a pretty good, decent price if you need uh, prescription goggles in a, in a rush without having to mess around with your cylinders and your you know your cylinder your eye cylinders and your diop no not diopters um what's that one that I said cylinders and spears and X's and all that it just it's good to go as you buy it. Um it as far as I know when I received this um I didn't really have to ex assemble it. But the previous set that I got, I had to accept, uh, assemble it like these comes already attached. I just had to put in the nose piece and the straps. But um, I can't remember if I had to ex assemble it for this um, second 
goggles that I bought recently. So yeah, um, that's 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 it for this one. I line. I'll put a description down in the box below, and you can see or buy. Check them out for yourself if you need uh, prescription goggles. The other brand that I really like, which I unfortunately I don't, um, I can't buy another set. Oh, in this style anyway, I can't buy another one. These are Aquavis swimming goggles. Um, sorry if it's all backwards. Like I said, the, the camera is on reverse view and everything is backwards. <laughs> so um, these are Aquavis. I really like these because these are made for Asian faces. The previous pair that I had of this particularly style of Aquavis goggles was just a normal one and I sort of complained to the on their Facebook I said I Facebook page and I said I really like using these but um, they leak at my nose and how can I fix it what can I add to fix it and the reply I got was you can't fix it because it's molded but I'll send you an Another frame that we have, which is made for Asian faces, and um, I said how much because I was willing to pay for an extra one that actually fit me and not leak. So I said how much, and she and he she I I can't remember it was a man or a woman that emailed me, but uh, said that I could have it for free because my previous ones were leaking. And I did not, you know, that's that's probably customer satisfaction or whatever it's called. But he said, I can have these ones for free to try out and then, and, and so forth and such. And I said, okay, free stuff. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> so I got these and I have been using them for a very long time since then. So I got these in, in I think it was 2015, a year after I started. So... They've, they've been through a lot and uh, um, the silicon, the the gasket part of the frame and the strap is all silicon. So the silicon has just started to go and started to warp. It does do its job of not leaking on my, around here. So, um, but I want another one because the silicon at the same time of warping has started to go a bit yellowish if I hold it up to the light or I just press my fingers into it I can see start to go a bit yellowish it's not as clear as it once was but I still like I still do like this brand because this is the only brand that I found so far that has the uh, removable uh, inserts so you just stick your finger in in here uh, under the frame and you just pull it out and the, the the lenses come out of your goggles and the best thing I like about this brand is interchangeable so it can go from this into this normal uh, swimming goggles and it just goes in with a snap and then it's on see it's, it's not falling out it's on and the reason, another reason why I haven't been using uh, the Aquavis goggles is because my uh, my uh, eye prescription changed recently and um, it's not quite high anymore. It's it's lower in degrees and uh, these are I think this one is I think it's minus eleven point seven five on this side on the right side and a minus 9 or 10 or minus 10 something 10 point something on this side so they have uh, decreased quite a bit and that's why I ended up buying these ones at the start of the year and these have served me quite well so far so um yeah, so I that's why I haven't been using them. Even though I want a new 
uh, frame. I haven't been able to find anywhere that sells the Asian fit frame. Um, I might have to email them again and ask them when I, you're going to start selling it because I and many of my uh, Asian peoples, <laughs> they we want in a leak-free option for swimming goggles. So I do quite like these. Um, I use this one, the snorkel version, when I like to just like to hang upside down and watch the people swim past. <laughs> so um, the last one I got is this $50 um, diving mask. I'm not really a fan of this style because it's very big compared to this Ecovis one. Um, how do I put it? So it's very big compared to this one and this one. See, it's like a size difference. So these, when I'm doing the dolphin kick motion, you know how you go like this up and down, up and down motion. When this is on my face, I can feel the whole, the lens and the frame and whatever, the, the whole goggle really. And it, and it, it sort of goes like this on the face. As you're doing the dolphin kick and um, it's and because it's also slightly heavier than these uh, polycarbonate lenses and the plastic frame it's it's, it's, it's it's doing that motion whenever I swim with it on my face and I don't really like that and I'm, another reason that I haven't swum in this as much is because you don't get a bigger view even though it's prescription inside. By bigger view, I mean like these ones. You see how it's clear? Even if I look down a little bit, I can still see whatever's on the bottom. Like say the swimming pool bottom or the the, the um, uh, beach bottom. So even if I just look to the side a little bit, I can still see what's on the other side. Whereas this one... It just feels like I'm wearing, uh, you know, when the horses wear the blinkers, they wear them like this so they can only see in one direction at a time. <laughs> That's what it feels like when I'm wearing these <laughs> blinkers. <laughs> so, um, yeah, don't, don't really use them as much as I like to, but um, they cost $50, by the way. They were on special. I'm not really sure if they're on special, but I'll have a look for you later on. But yeah, these cost $50. And um, I don't know, maybe I got a bad one or maybe I accidentally knocked it or something. But when I turn in a certain angle, um, it leaks from the inside here in just this side. It doesn't leak on the other side. So it only leaks this side. I don't know why. Maybe it doesn't... Maybe the goggles doesn't like being in that angle and, and sort of telling me, ah, stop it, I, stop it, you're leaking. <laughs> I'm going to leak on your eyeballs. So yeah, it leaks, it leaks in here. So that's why I don't re wear it as well. And because, I don't know, it just feels really more, more suffocating than this goggles. This goggles, I don't feel anything. I just, just put the lens in, I put on on my face and I go swimming. This one... I feel like I, <laughs> it's so big. I feel like I can't see anything. I can't um, do certain tricks because it leaks. And, um, you know, it just feels suffocating. So I don't use this quite as much as I said. Um, I think the gasket part and the, the strap is silicon. But um, you can buy the lenses separate and they'll assemble it for you at the shop or the, the the people that they order it from will assemble it for you in their premises they are not like these goggles where you can just buy separately and assemble it yourself but these are uh, more technical and more specific they have to do it at their shop so um i think that's it for our um goggles look um my favorite yes and this brand yes but uh this gigantic one no <laughs> so yeah yeah 
um, that's all I have to show you for my uh, goggles. Um, I've got a couple of videos I've still got to edit and I haven't got around to because my GoPro is not behaving. I probably need a new one. <laughs> so, um, yeah, um, I think that's all I have to say for now. Uh, happy swimming and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.